Hey, what's up guys? It's your girl Keiko Olingas back with another review for you right here on CheesyCam.com. And today the product I'll be looking at is Kessler's Pocket Jib Traveler. Now what sets this particular jib apart is its extremely light and compact form factor. Unlike most jibs that require assembly, the Pocket Jib Traveler contains no loose parts and is one foldable piece that starts off at 27 inches broken down and can reach a circular travel distance of 72 inches when fully extended. The jib itself weighs only 5.5 pounds but can hold camera rigs up to 10 pounds. If you look up close, a large attribution to the lightweight nature of the pocket jib traveler are the weight reducing window cuts you'll find lying across the center of the bars. It also contains a slidable weight bar that reduces the overall counterbalance weight needed to properly balance the jib, which in turn reduces the required load necessary for your shoots. It also contains drag control and locks, a feature that controls most functions of the jib, including locking, tilting, and weight distribution. Now, one standout feature that the Kessler Pocket Traveler jib has that most others don't is a panning base, which allows you to get those very smooth side-to-side -side camera movements without the need of a fluid head. Simply loosen the ratchet lever to activate panning and tighten it back up to lock it in place. At the mounting base, you'll find a 3 8 as well as 2 quarter by 20 inch threaded holes that will allow you to mount the jib onto any standard tripod. Those same mounting holes can be found up front on the camera basket where you can either set up your camera directly or add your own quick release plate for easy on and off access. One thing to keep in mind is that by adding a quick release plate or any additional camera accessories such as a follow focus or lens filters, you will essentially make your jib setup a little more front heavy. So make sure you compensate that with extra weight on the back. Now, as you can see, I already have the jib set up, but now I want to take it out on the field and put it to use. But this time, I'll go ahead and show you step by step on how to put this guy together. So, let's go ahead and check it out. All right, so I got this set up again. I'm ready to shoot some of the beautiful scenery around me. Just to show you what I'll be working with, today I'll be shooting with a 5D Mark III using a 24 to 105 f4 lens, and it's mounted on a Kessler quick release plate. And to balance the jib out, I've only added five additional pounds of weight with the sliding weight bar, providing the rest of the resistance. All right, enough talk, let's get this going. Well, that wraps it up for me here. As you can see, I was able to get some pretty amazing shots with this guy. For more information on Kessler's Pocket Jib Traveler, be sure to log on to our site at cheesycam.com. I'm Keiko Lingus, and I'll see you guys next time.